I think the facet that I'd like to talk about is the social cohesion of the staff over many years, especially in the early years, because the staff got along together very well. We used to meet very often um, on academic terms, but also socially. So there would be social functions on campus and also social functions that would be organised off campus. So quite often we would get together in both the academic and social ways. Um, there were uh, staff rooms scattered over the campus and each group or department would meet together um, for morning tea and lunch so there'd be lots of social interaction. And then there was a general area where all staff could come together and they would often, those, those functions were really very social and people got along together. Um, also in the early days many of us were young and had young families so some of the social functions involved our families so there'd be a Christmas party that would be organised for the families and that would be down at the pool so that was a, a great function we all got to know each other's families and children and so on and that meant that we'd often visit each other's homes um, and got to know the people in our academic areas very well. So it was the social cohesion um, and also the academic cohesion. We all sort of knew where we were coming from. We all had this vision for educating teachers and producing teachers that would be of a high standard um, for the Queensland uh, scene. A proud moment would be having students come back from practice teaching and talk to me about their experiences in a classroom where they had implemented some of the strategies and activities that I had um, shown to them in lectures and workshops. And they would have used these in a classroom, found that they were successful and came back and told me how successful they were. And that was really quite a satisfying thing to, to hear my students saying, yes, this works and uh, it just gave me confidence uh, in what I was doing.